Hey guys, welcome back to Season 2, Episode 28 of our Technic Underground playthrough. And today, we're actually going to be doing something relatively different. Last episode we left off, we actually had worked on our nuclear reactor. We actually made a way to turn it on or off through a wireless signal. And as you can see here, it's currently off. Now it is on. This is a uh, pretty neat technology, if I might say so myself. I fairly like that quite extensively. I think that's pretty neat. So that's one way to do it. Uh, last episode I said I was going to show you guys this down here, but I didn't get to it. But anyways, these are five MFEs on top, five MFEs on the bottom. All of them are fully loaded and fully ready to go currently are only hooked up to receive power not to output power I will have to figure out what I am going to do with it soon I am not sure yet and how I'm going to hook this up but I am considering to have this as our backup power now how much is this you say well this is 600,000 so this each one of these is 1.2 1.2 1.2 1.2 1.2 so that's pretty much 6 million EU which is about a million more than half of what an MFSU is so it kinda tells you how <laughs> how hard it is to make these those are fairly simple to make compared to the MFSU's but anyway let us get on to ooh, wow, look at all the guys in there hey they got friends friends of friends and buddies and all alike today I want to work on a few things that I need to I think I should just go ahead and finish up and do get it over with. Anyways, we have our red guitar here. This is basically, you know, our you know, all of our power for our weapon. This is our shovel, our pick, our axe, our shears, all that stuff. We got our red matter armor so we're fully indestructible. And I was thinking about it and I was like, you know what? Let's go ahead and make our Klein Stars. We're gonna go ahead and make a Klein Star this episode, and if we can, we'll try to see if we can't make the Ring of Arcana today. So let's get to work. Now, what I'm going to need for the Omega is I'm going to need to start at Klein Star Ein, I believe it's what it's called. Ein. So we're going to need, what is, was that Altenarius fuel or Mobius? Dang it. Mobius. Alright, Mobius fuel is easily obtained by taking Atenarius fuel if you have it, putting it there, taking your Philosopher's Stone, and bam, you get Altenarius, or Mobius fuel. So another way to get Altenarius fuel if you don't have it is by working your way up. So say for instance you have, let's see, I'm just going to go over this for people that might not know. So if you have coal, right, you're going to take, I'm going to take four coal. I mean, you're probably going to need a whole heck of a lot more than this. So I am might as well just go ahead and do this to the full extent that I can. Just to show you. Alright, so if you place it in this pattern in a crafting square with your Philosopher's Stone, you're going to get alchemical coal. You can take these alchemical coals, place them in the same arrangement, it'll give you Mobius fuel. If you take those Mobius fuel, place it in the same arrangement, it'll give you the highest Atenarius fuel. So, little tip there. Also, you can take... I think you can take diamond blocks. No, that's no, 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 no. I'm I'm mistaken. I'm sorry. I'm thinking of something else. I'm thinking about how to make dark matter. Dark matter's taking out scenarios fuel and surrounding it by a, a block of diamond. So we need a diamond. We need a diamond. Do I have any diamonds today? Diamond, diamond, diamond. I have a block of diamond. That'll work. Uh, thank you. Oops, that is definitely not what I wanted. Alright, we will surround this guy. This will make us a Klein Star Ein. Now, this is all we need. That's all we need to do. We have a whole bunch of coal. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. But anyway, good little quick tip is that you see these have an EMC value. They are relatively easy to make. I'm just going to go ahead and make them as simplistically as I possibly can, which is this way right here. Now, as you can see, they are not stackable, so we just need 
take all these. In fact, I probably should have to take all these because I don't know if you can recondense them down. <laughs> I don't think I can. Let's, let's see if we can. Yeah, they don't recondense down, so I need to just make sure I can grab a few of these. So how much are these worth? There's one, there's two. We're going to have to be careful. I'm going to have to go get rid of these, too. I don't need all that. Uh, let's see. Right here. This is my throwaway pile. I don't need all these guys. Actually, I could just go ahead and... I guess I could just... Oh, I can't shift-click them up. Dang it. they got to make it all hard on me, don't they? That's one. We'll just hold on to these. I just don't like having all of them around. Alright, so we should have plenty of these. Now. Let's see. Oh. Alright, so we got eins. We got two zways. So we got four zways. So you just take these four zways. This will give us Dre. So now if we put this guy in here. I'm just going to uh, put these guys aside. They can't really do too much for us anymore. We'll put in some dark matter to give us enough of these guys, which is, which is four. So we'll take our four Drays. Hopefully I'm pronouncing them right. We get a Veer. So we'll take a Veer, place it in here, put a red matter in here. All right, there we go. So now we have four a Veer. Please, four Veer in here. I believe this will give us the Schwier. Schwier. <laughs> we'll put a Schwier up here. And now we just need to get us one, <gasps> two, and three of those. And this actually should make us a Omega. There we go. So now this guy is not charged. We do need to charge him, and one way to charge him that I know of is coming over here to your trans uh, wait, transmutation tablet, I believe is what it's called. Transmutation. I can't remember. It's been a while since I used it. Anyways, put your Omega on the left side. You'll notice that it actually learns it, so if you want to make another one, you can. Just take your red matter, put it up in there. As you can see, it went up a little bit. We have over 5 million EMC in there. We're going to fill this up. Wow, I'm going to have to go over and get some more red matter to fill this guy up. So we're going to pull out a dark matter so we can transmute it. Just two for safekeeping. Just go ahead and fill this thing up. There we go. So now we're somewhat relatively, <laughs> somewhat relatively uh, picked up on this guy. Uh, we shouldn't have to worry about fuel. Oops, fuel for a while uh, because of these things. Uh, hold a lot of EMC which is basically so I use it probably about one Altenarius fuel for my ring every probably every 20 minutes I would say uh, if it's not on now if you push C and turn it on it keeps the mobs away and it probably lasts about five or ten minutes I would say I'm not saying those times are accurate but it's just what I've noticed so uh, you can kind of see from 8,000 e EMC to, you know, nearly 40 million EMC, yeah, how long it would probably last, last you a little while, so. Now I want to go ahead and get to making our Rings of Arcana. Now, I don't really know when I started this episode, so <gasps> forgive me, but I am going to need to run over to, it looks like I might need to if I don't have any red matter on me my bags anywhere which I don't we're gonna have to make a quick stop to Bentville we're gonna have to go pick up some more EMC so let's uh let's go the quickest way possible which is our little I don't know let's uh let's, let's do a little running today why not I want to let that thing charge up anyway plus it's nice outside it's clean, clean outside today, today. All right, we're going to just skip over our house. We're going to come over here to... <sighs> doop, into our EMC room. Pick up another couple... 
pounds of red matter. Yeah, I'm referring to pounds. Lol. Now, someone was asking me where I got this sword, and I mean, if you're watching Thumbcraft, I am going to go ahead and say this right now, that I did actually find another sword in a chest underground. So you do have a chance of finding these underground. Um, it was actually in a different world, so... You don't know, we might run into one into this one as well, but that is not here nor there. We are ready to get back to work and get our rings going. So now we're going to need to make us up some good stuff here. Ring of Arcana is made up of a Switch Wars Ring Ring Gadget, which we have. Ring of Ignition, a Zero Ring, and a Harvest Goddess Band. Now let's start at the Ring of Ignition. We're going to need four pieces of flint and steel. Alright, four flint and steel. So we're going to need some flint. I know I got everything in my bag somewhere in here. We will definitely find it. There's flint. See where am I? At? Where am I? At? Oh, why don't I just take this guy and throw him in? He oh God, I knew that was gonna happen. Gosh, dang it! All right, I need four of these. One, two, three, four. All right, we'll take dark matter. Crap! There we go. There we go. All right, we're gonna need two dark matter anyway. <laughs> All right, so we need two dark matter. We're going to need an iron band, which is fairly simple to make. Some Mobius fuel, which we still have. I'm going to unequip that so I make sure it doesn't burn that up. Now, to make a iron band, we need iron. We're going to need iron, and we're going to need bucket of lava. Now, I'm pretty sure I saved a bucket of lava somewhere. And if I didn't save a bucket of lava, I'm going to have to go pick one up. Let's see. I don't want to have to make another bucket, so... Got one right there. Alright, let's... We're going to dupe some lava here. I'm going to need a little bit. Come here, buddy. I need you for a minute. do 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 and just place him right there. That's going to give us one bucket of lube. Now we're going to need to go into crafting square. We're going to take iron. We're going to put it in a circle like this. And lava in the center. That gives us an iron band. You do get your bucket back as well. We need two dark matter. Mobius fuel on top and bottom. Flint and steels in the corner. And that will give us our ring of ignition. Now this powder of this guy needs to only be used outside it is uh, quite powerful don't really want to show it underground or near oh no that scared the poop out of me all right so v to charge it up right click it's not working so left click left click and left clicks throwing fireballs that aren't doing anything to that's not really working okay guy you're getting on my nerves all right so let's see maybe right click on here like this all right this is kind of weird oh whoa 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 so right click apparently starts lots of fires. Lots of fire. Now why the left click isn't working, sometimes these things don't work. Now R sometimes will do a special effect as well. I think that's just pretty much what that does. Yeah, R is pretty much the same. So lots of fire, lots of fun. Uh, not sure why the fireball is not working. Shift clicking, that's not working. Alright, this guy's getting on my nerves. Mr. Man, why don't you come up here? Oh, you didn't like that? Here. Enjoy that. Oh, wait, what about this? How about flying over there? Oh, that didn't feel good. <laughs> 
Come here. Come here, Ogre. Whee! Dunk. Whee! <laughs> right on top of the werewolf. So you guys didn't know, actually, werewolves are actually easier to kill this way. A little tip for you guys. Doing it this way. They uh, actually die relatively quick. So you see how much damage it takes. They don't really take a lot. Uh, so yeah, the uh, the ring. I'm not sure why it's not like doing anything with the fireballs because I do remember it. Oh, G did something. Okay, G, you want to leave off? Push G again. <laughs> G is everywhere you walk. You'll start a fire behind you. Do you see as I'm flying here? It's pretty much starting a fire. I don't really want that on. Uh, that's all I can kind of figure out from the ignition ring. So I always thought it did more than that, but it might be different somewhere else. Let's see, here we go. Let's get inside, away from all the craziness outside. So next off, we want to make up a zero ring. Now, zero ring, we're gonna need snow, snowballs. And dark matter, so we're gonna go ahead and grab a couple more buckets of lava. Put that in there. Half this up, make us up some dark matter. Let's see, I need snow. Now to make snow, I'm gonna need to get snow, and to get snow, I'm gonna have to go find snow. And to find snow, I need to know where my snow biome's at. Where's my snow biome at? I don't quite remember if I ever even had a snow biome close by. Be honest with you. Let's see, uh, there wasn't one that way. Not that there wasn't one that way. That's desert jungle. That's more jungle. That's jungle. Way out that way is all just regular. Hmm. All right, well, let's take a look at snow. Let's make snow. Crap. Didn't click off. There we go. All right, so snow, snow, snow by snowballs. I can make rock crusher, snowball, ice. Macerator can take ice. Compressor. A water cell? That works, too. So we'll do that. We'll take some water cells and put it in a compressor then and see uh, how well that works. Alright. Easy way to make snow, right guys? Uh, we're gonna need some tin. So we need about four pieces of tin. Open up our crafting square. We're gonna make some water cells. Grab us up some water cells from here. Two, three, four. I declare a thumb war. That should be good for now. Come over to our compressor room. What's going on here? Oh, graphical glitch. Did I put a roof on this yet? Oh, I did put a roof on this. Beast mode. All right, so these guys are ready to go. Nice snowballs, indeed. Uh, kind of buggy, it looks like, but all right. Well, I need. Oh, it took it out. Okay. I gotcha. It pumped it all out. That's fine. That will work. So now I need to make a piece of snow block, which is perfect because now I can actually dupe this. Now we have plenty of snow forever and ever. And by the time this video is coming out, it's probably going to be about Christmas time. So I want to go ahead and say a Merry Christmas to everyone that's still around, that's still watching the video. I appreciate you guys sticking around and always appreciate you guys all the time. So I want to say a thank you for sticking around. Alright, and did I just put that bloody snow block in here and lose it? Son of a biscuit eater. That's what I get for opening my big mouth. <sighs> Whatever. I think I got a compressor in here. Yeah, I got a compressor in here. I'll, uh, do this real quick. Get some of our clockers. We can speed this thing up real quick. One, 
two, so I'm gonna fly all the way back over there. One, two, three, and four, unless I'm totally missing it, which I'm not. There we go. Put you in there. Hello, Snow. How are you doing this evening? Yeah, so... <laughs> well, I just dug a hole that I probably can't get myself out of. Right. Alright, well, anyway. I'm going to put a snow block down. Break it. Uh, with this, maybe? There we go, snowballs. Alright, so... We need to put the snow away. Do I have a bag that has any room for snow? Okay, let's go ahead and clean that up. Alright, now... Let's go to... Ring... Or R-I, sorry, in G. Bring up our rings. We need the zero ring. So we need four pieces of snow, two snowballs, two dark matters. Let's see, we're going to need a bucket of lava in the middle. Iron ingots. To make another iron band. Dark matter up in top. Snowballs on left and right. I put away snow that I should have kept four pieces of. Let's try this again. And band. Snowballs. Dark matters. And snow. Gives you a zero ring. Now, this guy is a little bit weird. If I'm not mistaken, he actually... Oh. Oh. <gasps> no, don't do that. No. No. No, I'm sorry. Oh, gosh. Um, 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 um. Is it... Oh, I don't want to right click with this. Oh, crap. <sighs> okay, anyway. We'll do this uh, up here. Anyways, left clicking throws snowballs. Which is super duper fun. And right clicking uh, lays down snow. So there you go. I'm pretty sure that's all this does. You push G, activates as you see it turns it on, and it will make snow everywhere you go. So if you want to make a wintry wonderland, by all means you can. It is Christmas time, it's festivities, and all around, you see I got my Santa hat on underneath my, uh, my red matter armor there. Looking good. So we'll go ahead and turn that off. We got our zero ring made up, and we'll, uh, I'll have to pick that mess up in a little bit. And finally, last but not least, we need to make the goddess band. So we can actually ac access that one through here. We're going to need two sets of flowers. We're going to need four saplings, two dark matter, some iron. Be good to go. All right. So do I have any iron anywhere? Any iron anywhere? Hello, iron. Irone. It's muy irony. Okay, I'm gonna take that as a no. We're gonna to go over here and pick some up real quick. Uh, come here. Come hither. You are a big slime. You're lucky this does not hurt you. AoE style. So then I would totally kick your butt. Oh, a piece of snow. Alright. We got iron. We need to go ahead and make us up one last iron band. There we go. Now I need all of our goodies. So I believe it's actually in this other room over here that we uh, shipped all of our goods out on. Um, okay. Oh, there it is. There it is. I was going to say, I guess I don't have any. <laughs> but I do. I do. We'll put a piece of snow away for a just in case later scenario. I know I got some flowers around here somewhere. Two, two yellow flowers. Okay. And yeah, take our iron band, our saplings, our flowers. You can put them in top or bottom. And dark matter. Okay, apparently they have to be <laughs> this way. I thought they could have been either way. 
Okay, so I think I'm doing something wrong then. Let's go ahead and pull up the Ring of Arcana. What am I doing wrong? Dark Matter. Flower. Oh, it needs to be one of each. Ah, it can't be two yellows. Crap. Let's go find a red. Hey, look a red. <laughs> go figure! Alright, throw that out of my inventory. Put you there. Two of you there. One. Whoops. One, two, three, four. And then this in the center. There we go. So it has to be a red and yellow. Alright, now the harvest band actually... It's actually kind of weird. It speeds up growth of plant life around you. Uh, if you right click, left click, I don't really see it do anything. Uh, there's no charge on it. You can see grass kind of growing around me. Uh, a G actually looks like it uh, harvests everything in the area. Oh, oh, it'll harvest everything, so it'll pick everything up. Nice. So it's like a really big lawnmower. Nice. So if you guys need need a lawnmower, uh, this is definitely where you want to get your lawnmower. Uh, they're not very cheap this time of year, but you know you can definitely uh, definitely uh, have some fun with this. I think. Uh, now you turn it off. It's going to start growing again. I'm not. I don't think R does anything in this. So it just it's gonna speed up everything. But anyways, we need to go back and get our ring of arcana going. So let's get it going. Pretty simple to make at this point. Take our swift force surrendering gale, goddess band, ring of ignition, void or zero ring, not the void ring, and then we just take our red matter, place it around, and we'll have the ring of arcana. Looks like I got my zero ring in harvest band back. I don't think I get my Swift Force or my other one back, so I'll just throw these away for now. Don't need all that. So now we have all the power of all those rings in one with no pew, pew anymore. So let's come up here. Uh, as you can see, it's going to change colors. Uh, right now it's red, so I believe it's uh, on fire, I believe. I push R. It does the whole thing there. For some reason I don't think... Oh, there it is. I don't think it has a charge to it. So anyways, C changes uh, the ring. This is the rendering gale one, I believe. As you see, right clicking this <laughs> launches it up in the air. Screw the eggs! I don't think R does anything on this one, so we'll switch this one to this. Play that place a waypoint. And this one will just do everything the gun just banded. Except now it has a swing sound to it. But I don't think it does anything. Just making the grass grow. One more time. This is our snowball one. Right click, throws the snowballs. R does a little bit of snow. So I mean, it's. I don't know. I think the original ones are probably a little bit bigger. If you, better if you want to do a bigger scale. This one's a little bit better if you want to do a fine-tuned scale and have them all in one. Back to fire. We're good to go. So, anyways guys, I'm going to go ahead and wrap that up there. Hope you guys enjoyed. I know it's been a little long episode of me crafting, experimenting, and showing, but I wanted to go ahead and make all that up. It's probably been a really long episode, so hopefully you guys enjoy. Please rate the video and let me know what you guys think down below. A like would be appreciated if you guys would. And until next time, I will see you then. Goodbye.